Welcome back to Mega Man Saving, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry if I sounded like a bit of a jackass in the last part, but in this part, we're gonna start off with the Junk Man. Well, to be fair, that is what you are. Garbage Day! Let it go. They were originally going to call it another thing, but frickin' um, Danny DeVito had to sue us. Oh. <laughs> From him! But wait, this came out long before Danny DeVito took on the role of pro wrestling. I know. Hi, but we ever, have you ever seen Always Sunny? I feel like I've asked this question already, and I apologize if I have already. Well, he's referenced, referenced it a few times, at least in the Danny DeVito bits. Real quick, I gotta take the dog out. I'll be right back. All right, okay. okay. Trying to dodge the question, eh? Yeah. <laughs> he's gotta take his dog out to trash day. But anyway, um, yeah, um, interesting little fun fact regarding Junkman stage. Um, apparently, apparently, like, um, if you look with look up in like the ceiling and all that stuff, you might actually see um pseudo Super Famicom looking contraptions. That were un yeah. that are unfortunately being cut for the Legacy Collection too. Oh, they don't uh -huh. want to show them anymore. Pro oh, probably nope. because probably because it's going to be a multi-console release. Yeah. Yeah, and and it's still ironic to me that it's not coming on the Nintendo system as of yet. Yeah. Which I which I find is like Capcom being assholes, but they're mm, assholes or, just... or well more so idiots honest, honestly because like Mega Man is well yeah you can have Mega Man on just about anything but he's always stuck out the most on Nintendo. Whoa. So yeah, with the elect with the um the electric spark thingy we got from uh, Cloud Man, we can we actually turned on the battery, and now we can use this little conveyor belt to get ourselves a neat little secret. Okay. Yay. Uh, what was I gonna say? Um, going up. I, I, I've just been kind of like ticked lately. I've been checking like the Nintendo Switch Reddit and oh, stuff. Oh shit! Careful, don't get crushed. I've been checking the Nintendo. Oh jeez. Almost. I've been checking the Nintendo Twitch Reddit, and all I've been seeing or what is that? This. Is our rush jet? Rush jet. Yep, they, the, that's how you get your rush jet in this game. Huh? Huh? Thought they would have given it to you normally, but okay, that's fine. I like it. Well, to be fair, you did have to fight fight for your rush jet in every other game. Only this time, you had to fight it out in the open as opposed to like beating a boss in order to get it. Unfortunately, the rush jet. I mean, you can still use it in this game if you want to, but. There's a neat little something we're gonna get later on that's gonna completely um, make it's gonna it's gonna. Hey, completely... at least you can control it going up and down now. That was helpful. Man, that's a good point. Yeah, at the same time, though, you can't you can't really abuse it the same way you could in Mega Man Three. So Ooh. you can never forget. I know. That. Sorry, but, um, I'm sorry, I was asking you real quick. Hype, have you seen? I, have you actually been, have you actually seen episodes of Always Sunny, or do you just know like some of the scenes from it? I just know some scenes of it mainly because of that whole. Um, not so much rumor, but thing that people want for that Detective Pikachu movie. <laughs> oh, right, right, all the audio. Okay, I got, again, uh, I'm gonna yeah. watch some episodes of these. There are some things, we, we, there are things we have to watch. By the way, just going to say, I love Dane DeVito, but my favorite character, my favorite person on that show is, uh, is Charlie Day. He's fucking oh, like hilarious. Charlie. Anyway, before I, I lose challenge my you, oh. good sir, oh, wait, to a duel. I Guys, accept. Hang on. <laughs> wait, Matt, hang on. James, what's happening here? What is this? It's the Junk Man! Who's actually about as easy as Cloud Man if you know how to proper, properly deal Whoop. with him. Kill him! Kill him! Oh. Uh, maybe it's just me, but it looks like... Oh boy. Maybe it's just me, but it kind of looked like when he did that jump there, it kind of sucked you into the okay, trash. To be... Okay, let's be... to be fair here, um, I made this boss look ha much harder than it really is. Observe. Oh. Mm. This is... When you do it, it, it makes it... it makes him have to do that move when he jumps? Yep. Oh. You can, really you can consider an electric, uh, an electric twitch. Wow, that uh, was easy. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, Cloud Man's still easier, but at least I mean, at least Junk Man tried to fight back. Now, yeah. before before I lose my earlier point, as much as I love the Rush Jet, it's gonna get it's gonna be um, replaced completely by something we'll get later on in the game. Okay, fairly quickly too. So yeah, okay. Well, let's see what oh, yeah, we that's get right. here. Uh, voicing Matt. The Junk Shield will protect the user with with rotating spears, right? I can't speak today. Yes, but you may actually realize it's kind of a, kind of a ripoff of the Leaf Shield scene from a previous, more popular Mega Man game. No fucking also, shit! Also, it's quite unsanitary by comparison. So it's the Leaf. It's the new Leaf Shield. More or less. Yeah. Rock. The more you say those words, the more I'm very tempted to install that filter in you. Fuck oh, you, old this? man! Here. Oh, oh shit! Sub -boss. Damn, Eddie, you got an upgrade. Blast it! Shoot him! Oh, that's not a boss, what? Nope, there's a reason behind this. This is actually our shot. Whoa! Oh. 
Welcome to Big Yeti. Welcome to Big Yeti's. Oh. I'm right. Otto, Dr. Light's number one student. I was waiting for Unfortunately, him. I have lost one of my bolts and a couple of screws loose. If you catch my drift, <laughs> I would appreciate it if you bring the hyperbolt back here. Anyway, I'll try my hardest to make items out of other bolts you may find. Select the item you want me to make. Please do not worry about my compatriot. He has got the disco fever. <laughs> um, by the way, Otto, are you ever gonna get that voice voice chip fixed? And do t okay. So, what are these items? Okay, so well, one of them you could buy is technically Beat, but unfortunately, Beat is um somewhere in one of the other stages we have to find first. Okay, uh, and then E tanks. But yeah, you could buy E tanks, extra lives, weapon tanks, an exit module, which you can actually find uh, find somewhere in Ooh. one of the stages if you're lucky enough. And it, the exit is just a one time, like once you have it. Works. Don't ask me why I was making something on the table, and yet obviously the thing came from the ceiling. You do Ooh, not know. Ow. Do you? You do not want to know what I am looking at. Oh, like cute. I said, I have a few screws loose. That was cute. <laughs> Is there a leak? So long, Mega Man. It's okay. See, so it's like the center Ooh. thing to go. Okay, so oh, now boy. now it's time for Freeze Man. The Ice Man comes. Usually, beginners start with this guy first, and then realize that was a terrible fucking mistake. Because we've always thought the Ice Person is the first person you start with in Mega Man games. I don't think that's the case with Ice Man. Penguin, Ice Man. Uh, who starts with Iceman? Really? I start with no. Iceman. Dude, I will start with Cupman, or Bobman, as I, after I figured out that's actually the first one you're supposed to go after. Oh, mm -hmm. well, so... Polar Bear but, got... But even, and even then, Logan, let's not forget the goddamn block puzzle, which you can't which you can't even exploit without the magnet beam. Fair enough. So... So anyway, welcome to Freeze Man stage. We got to deal with a bunch of robotic polar bears! Oh, no! Oh, God! When you're turning into endangered species, you insensitive prick. Come on, too late, they're dead. But oh, what's Logan, this? Steve, we can rebuild him. Guys, no, it's something Stop. worse. Right. It's something worse. The e Rob Schneider has finally gone insane and assimilated the polar bears into norms. You mean it's an army of the north? Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's the norm of the north, yo. Oh god. I, just, I feel like. I mean, I'm not gonna be complete. Okay, hang, okay, careful. I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bash Rob Snyder for everything. I feel like the guy needs a paycheck. So, uh, to be fair, Mike Pollock and Dan and Travis Dan Willingham Green. freaking did Little Panda Fighter. Yeah, that was Dan Green. I know they have the exact same voice, but still. I keep fixing him up all my. Okay, that time I was like, oh, that sounded like Knuckles. That must be Travis Willingham. I got it right this time. Oh jeez. Well, to be fair, it was Knuckles, just a different Knuckles. Oh, but wait, if I'm not mistaken, guys, we I think we got all four letters four letters of Russia's name. Wait, where do we get the S from? I remember the U from Cloud Man. Uh, the S is... Uh, oh, wait, you, never mind, I forgot. You, the S is from Jugs Man stage, but I didn't actually have... I don't have the uh, proper ability to get that yet. I'm sorry. I kind of jumped ahead there. It's okay. Well, you Oops. fucked up. I got I got the spelling knowledge to match all of it. No. As a matter, as a matter of fact, um, the weapon we need is actually from Freeze Man here. We got all of Rush's name, you know, R U H Rush. Rush. The S is the silent. S is silent. Yeah. The S Double S damn it. Wait, what's that? Oh, that is the Ru that is the Rush search. Something that Kate that's uh, new to Mega Man Whoop. Seven. Uh, basically, if you use it in a particular spot, uh, uh, in the correct spot, I should also add, Rush can actually dig for an item below it. Otherwise, he otherwise he just. Aww. Aww. Yeah. Fetch boy. Come on, boy. You smell something? Dig! Dig! Dig, 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 He's, um... He's not doing anything. Okay, we'll just leave behind. That's what happens when you when you try to dig in a place that doesn't really have an item. Honestly, this is one of the most, one of the most, um... Using that item to get all the items is like the biggest case of trial and error in this game. Hey, Mega Man, do you like twerking? No. Because I was going to say, like... I was going to say, like, there's no real tell of to use it, are you? There is one tell that I can think of that's actually not too bad to, uh, that's actually not that, um, easy to miss. But at the same time, it might not, it might not, it might not occur to you at first to actually dig there. Oh, let alone use the item in general. There you go. Yeah, let's just use the rush coil. Call it, call it a day. Don't know why he didn't do that to begin with. Because it's James. He's bad at games. Tobogganing penguin balls. 
Takes one to know one, jerk one. <laughs> oh, jeez. I was gonna say, I love this. I love the Super Nintendo sound chip and what they use for dogs barking, whether it be Rush or Pluto. Oh God, yeah. A little high pitch. Yeah, and trust me, it. Trust me, I I do suck at games. I know I suck at games. You guys will see when we get to the Crash Warp. But here we are. And remember, that's the easiest of the Crash games. Shut up. Oh my. Anyway, here's Freeze Man. Again, you should not fight this guy at, for, at your first time, but once you have the junk shield, he's easy pickings. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's fair, si so it's Cyborg Sub-Zero? Sure, we'll go with that. I was about to say, if it, it makes you feel any better, Matt, that's... Sorry. Oh, sorry. No, you first, you first, don't worry. I was about to say, being fair, Matt, saying that could be seen as the same way of saying, like, um, Rayman Legends is easier than Origins doesn't change the fact that it's still pretty hard. By the way, uh, are we not gonna, are we not gonna, um, pay attention to the, uh, freaking skeleton in the background? Not only a skeleton, that looks, that, that is a robotic dinosaur. Yes, yes it's it robot, is. Robot, dinosaurs, robots made dino- uh, I don't know, anyway. The Freeze Cracker, what the fuck is with that name? It fires ice bullets, doesn't it? What if I told you about using that language in this household? I don't care. And the bullet you can't tell me what to do, old man! Other. So it's like a shotgun. Yeah, essentially. Hunk, I made you with my own hands. Who the hell And I can very it? well delete you if I so choose, Aunt Sally. Suddenly this happens. Oh, actual cutscene time. Wait, why are we doing that here? Welcome home, Mega Man. You are out. Welcome home, Mega Man, from picking up some milk at the grocery store. Dr. Light, what do you think of bass? I don't know. It's not really my kind of music. I prefer more reggae or rock and pop. <laughs> but... Oh, oh, well, um, well, his actions don't seem to indicate a threat. I don't believe he is our enemy. Though his name sounds kind of... Oh, what the... <laughs> Shush. You asshole. Shush inner voices in my head. I will turn <laughs> later. What's this? Wily is attacking the robot museum. The why robot does he... Museum? Why do we have to do that again? You must leave now, Mega Man. Well, because well, people, like... there are museums of human science and human... We can have museums of human anatomy. I don't see the purpose of why we can't have a robot museum as well. There's the problem with that, though. Uh, what if some jerkwad just, you know, comes in, hijacks one of the robots, and, uh, you know... Oh, God, there are actually going Mega Man villains here. Yep. Snake, Snake Man, Man, wherever that, that is. Thing, Pharaoh Man Pharaoh in the Pharaoh Man, Flame Man, Heat Man. Why is Pharaoh well, Man here? He wasn't bad, though. Yeah, well, the far left. Oh, Plant Man. They have Plant Man on the left. Oh. It's kind of ironic because... Oh, wait, what's his music? Yeah, what is I like this? his music. Yeah, it's nice. But it's you know what's nice. worse than that? <gasps> Wily Steely Guts Man! Oh, and there's Ring Man in the back as well. And Skull Skeleton Man. Man? Skull, Skull Man. Sorry. Skull Man, I think so, yeah. is no. maybe Aquaman? Well, not Aquaman, but um, Splash Man. Man. Aquaman didn't even <laughs> appear until the next game. I have an oh, idea! Geez. A clown. <laughs> with a it's very... A with Who a very the fuck is this? Man. What is it, James? Well... This big fat Harlequin is only weak on its head, and you obviously, and you need the thunder shock thingy in order Whoa. to beat it. Yeah, and it's just oh jeez. It's yeah. The hitbox for the head is pretty small. Seriously, yeah, well, honestly, it's about as small as its own head. I was about to say. I lose my head if it wasn't attached. I was gonna say I really did like that. Um, what was it? I did like that. Uh, Music rendition, whatever we were hearing back there, and like whatever that tune was in the museum. I'll look that up later. Oh yeah, it's pretty much a it's pretty much a whole bunch of classic Mega Man songs put into one. Yeah, the there we go. Dun, 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 well, you destroyed dun, 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 my head, which somehow destroyed my body, despite the fact that they're completely different entities. But okay. I know that tune. I know it's from Mega Man Two, but I don't know if it was Crash Man or Quick Man. Son, you done fucked up. Mega Man, it's a disaster. Wily and his robots are rampaging through the middle of the city. Um, Dr. Light, I saw Guts Man being taken. Isn't that your robot? Shut, Shut up. up. And Go. isn't Feral Man technically Dr. Cossack's robot? Yeah. Shut up. And wasn't Plant there Man Dr. Now. Someone Else's robot? But anyway, now now that uh, four robot masters are new robot masters on the scene, we should backtrack and get that uh, one letter I'm missing. That's not how lava works. How are you supposed to know that? It's fire, question, Matt. and you're supposed to think that fire lava can freeze over, which it really can. There you go. Okay. So now that we spelt, now that we actually got all four letters of Russia's name, we got the super adapter. What is that? Oh do? boy! It says "Screw you" to the oh. rush jet. Because it gives Ra Mega Man a nifty little armor, a detachable arm, and a double jump. Nice. Whoa. 
Oh, jeez! You idiot. But it does not protect against dunking. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So that's it in the next part, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to use this thing for all it's worth and take, d take down the rest of the Robot Masters. Till next time, everybody. Bye. Bye. Mega bye. Shut up.